decided to give this series another chance. We had a lot of people tell us to keep trying and that the first book wasn't a good judge of its whole character. So we're gonna try it again. Even by someone that watches this, the person, I see you girl, always commenting on all my stuff. Even you said to keep on going. So here we are. Here we be. We're gonna see. We're gonna give it its fair chance because we want to understand the hype. We're going to try. It's a floppy. Points for flop. I want to be yeah. a Sarah J. Mass stone. So it's like we didn't like hate the first one. It just was rough to get into it. And... The last one we gave a three. We are going to begin. A journey. A journey. This wall is not going to be blank for very long. We're going to actually do like a, um, what are we going to do? It's kind of like a eclectic collage kind of situation. Maybe. Yeah, like collage scrapbooky little guy. I have all these stickers and stuff from when I used to physically journal and when I was about to get into it um, that I never ended up using because I started doing my digital stuff. So they're all going to go here and it's going to be this cute little guy. Which I'm excited about because this wall is really boring. That will happen soon. I don't want to start. <laughs> I don't care about them. Did anyone ever think about that? This is not a check. Is this like a prologue? Is there a prologue? Oh, and then the part one. There is. Uh, okay. okay. Hello. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> so, we reached. We, we are at the beginning of chapter 11. 11! Stinking uh, chapter 11! Honestly, it's getting pretty good. Pretty good. Stuff's happening. That's making me like interested. Now I gotta let you read. We're that way. We're that way far. Can I ever talk? Anyways, we're that way. How do I say this? We are this far there into the book and it's getting good. Definitely better than the other one, mm -hmm. for sure. I understand why people say read the next one. At this point, I don't know if it's worth the hype yet. But again, only it's 100 there, pages though. in. So I'm like, okay, I could see if it goes in a certain direction that it could get really good. Yes. Yes. So. so hopefully it keeps going on this track. I definitely like Reese. He is now my favorite character. Mm -hmm, I won't too. say anything else because I'm not trying to spoil it for anyone who hasn't read this, but he is definitely making things more interesting. And so I'm not just like bored on my mind because Tamlin, who was the main Dude. guy in the first book, is boring.com. Mm -hmm. And so he was like meh in the be in the first book and now in this one, there's someone else to focus mm -hmm. on. And so... Reese is kind of snarky and that's kind of... Yeah. Tamlin's still here. I'm not like... Exp I'm not... Yeah like spoiling anything it's just there's a new character to care about now it's a lot more interesting in that regard definitely gonna keep reading though and i can definitely see it getting better so hopefully it keeps getting better and hopefully we find the reason why this is so popular but she was beating me i went out of the room and she starts chugging along without me when we have an unspoken rule that you're supposed to stop if someone leaves the room you kept reading before when during one of the books we read uh, which one <laughs> I win. I banish thee. Oh. Where am I going? Well, move your head to the left. Or, yeah. You see this key? Yeah, spot the cat. She's being scary. This. Looking at us. <laughs> this little being that, yep. is a whole is a whole feline. She's sitting next to us, but she's staring at us through the mirror. Yeah, she can see us through the mirror and she will just stare at us instead of looking at us like this way. So you look up and all of a sudden you realize that she's like, if you're watching this and you make it, you've made it to the end of any of my previous videos, I always say cat number one is Pepper, like as if we're all characters. This is cat number one. She's my cat. She wasn't, she didn't start off my cat. She's Sam's family's cat, but she's my cat now. This is Pepper. This is, this is, this is, this is Pepper. Pepper. This is Pepper. Come here. She likes to climb on her. Yeah. 
the parrot. Yeah, she'll she'll just stay like right here. Something I wanted to say is I am going to start linking. I'm going to start linking my social medias going forward, like within the description box of my YouTube videos. Um, and if you're someone that is interested in my reading journal, if you want to keep up with how I do my reading journals more, I'm going to be posting them more on my Instagram, like closer up pictures than what I show like just in the YouTube videos. And then I'm going to leave my Pinterest down below and I'm going to start every, how do I say this? Every picture that I get for my reading journal is from Pinterest and normally I just save them, but going forward, I'm going to put them on boards for each book so that you can access those pictures and what I've picked and everything. I don't know if any of you ever wanted to like copy what I'm doing or like get inspo for it or get the vibe of the book, however it is, or if you see a picture that you want to use for like something else, something else or I don't know. So I just figured I would organize it that way. In general, my Pinterest is gonna have all the boards for the vibes of the books. The My Instagram is going to have all the actual like sheets for you to see. So like the actual finished product rather than just whatever I can put in the video. And then you're gonna see what book I'm reading before it gets posted. So you know like if you What's care next? about it or not. And like any personal updates. And then I'm gonna be trying to be more active in terms of like Instagram stories, like live updates while I'm reading before the vlog comes out. All my stuff will be put down below. We're gonna keep reading. I'm expecting that it's 7.24. By 8 p.m. we're finishing the book. Easy. Easy breezy lemon squeeze. You don't seem confident. No. <laughs> it's like we have five more, 500 more pages. <laughs> So we're halfway. It's getting good. It is. All right. I'll admit it. It's good. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. I'm not trying to be salty. I wanted it to be good, but it just wasn't. The first book was rough. Like the first book. If was... the first book was written like this book, no problem. Mine, chapter thirty-two. She's in chapter thirty-one. Halfway through. It's fire. I definitely like the characters in this way more. Mm -hmm. You know, it's hard to say stuff about any book further in a series. Mm -hmm. Without, you know, Feyre doesn't annoy me nearly as much as she did in the first one. So sometimes I'm like, okay, girly really pop, but <laughs> the majority of the time she's all right. And I like the world better. And the book is definitely more interesting because there's not so much downtime as there was in the first, there was in the first one. It feels like there was nothing going on much for a while in the first one. Yeah, Weird. it felt like the first one was just like constantly sitting around. Mm -hmm. It was like I was reading about people sitting around, which was as boring as it was for me as it was for them, I'm sure. Not so much of that in this one. Yeah, it definitely picked up quicker, which has been good. As of right now, I'm thinking four. I agree. It's not a five to me yet. But who knows, we still have like a whole, we still have a whole half, half of a book seats. If you read the first book and you think it's as lame as we did, there's hope. At least up until this point, there is hope. That's what we shall say for now. But we're making dinner. We're having some mac and cheese. Mac and cheese. Some easy boxed mac and cheese because I was already a chef once today. And that's enough for me. And we're going to make some coffee in our cutie little mugs. We, we, went, mugs. we went to the store and got two new cutie mugs. Look at them. Are you joking me? Yeah, hers has that. Here. Hers has that nice like honeycomb pattern and then the bumblebee vibe Beautiful. and then mine has this cutie little mushrooms everywhere oh so cute they were five dollars each we're gonna go have mac and cheese I love him. I love him. He's the best and I love him. Right now at least. But all boys are always bad, so I don't know. Yes, girl. Yes. Yes, girl. We do not like toxic men over yonder.
I if you've read this book and you you know what's happening about right here you know <laughs> I'll eat hey, ketchup but where to the next the beginning of the next chapter <laughs> Why they gotta do her like that? I know. I was like, <laughs> that was unnecessary. Why'd you gotta call her out like that? <laughs> I'm like, we didn't need to add that in there, but all right. He's so ugly. You know who I'm talking about if you read this. He's so ugly. He's so ugly. Oh! <laughs> right? I was like, what just happened? Uh oh. I mean, this is not the time or the place. Uh -oh. But it happened. Oh, oh. right. Stinking Sarah J. Mass, Moss, thrown in there. And Sarah, you got the us there, twist. Sarah girl. You got us there. I can't even. Huh? What? What just happened? What's your rating? At least Are you going to say five? five? I was thinking five. You're saying five? I think so. That was good. I'm going to have to hit it with a five as well. Very unexpected considering we gave the first book a three. Got me. It got me. It got me. I didn't think it was going to get me, but it got me. Now we got to go get the next book. I feel bewildered. <laughs> yeah. I feel like... Especially at the end, I was like, whoa. Cliffhanger ending, for sure. A lot of sure. stuff happened that I wasn't ready for. You know when you get so excited to read a book or read an ending whenever that you start, like, skimming so much that you're, like, lost until the end of the book feels like a fever dream? A lot happened in I the last, like, like, four or five chapters. I was like, what is happening? Yeah, and I definitely wasn't reading it properly. I feel like I want to start rating it and, like, discussing it right from the start instead of waiting the next day. So, like we said... The rating was a five, obviously. Smut level. I mean, it definitely like talked about stuff. So four. It described. Well, you're right. You're right. I hit with a five. I you're right. Hit with a five. The, the descriptions bring there. Yeah, definitely five in terms of. Because it didn't describe every time it happened, but there were times when it did. Yeah. For sure, you're right. Five. Smut level five, meaning it happened a lot. Smutty town, whatever. I like her writing style now. I've decided. I originally didn't like it, and. It was an interesting story, but I honestly just think that if she had cut the first book in half, I would have been swept into her. Yeah, the first book kind of just dragged on, honestly. Yeah, I would have been swept into the world a lot easier, so I don't really put the writing style at fault. Some of the, this book was like cut, like the first book cut in half and this book melded yeah. into that book somehow. That would have made for a better story. Yeah, I do think the books are cut where they're supposed to be. I just think the first book could have been a lot shorter than it was. Like we will be getting the third book. <laughs> Yeah, I I don't even know. I just can't. Even. It definitely like had me hooked from the like really early on in this book, and then there it kept wanting to continue reading it. Yeah. Where the first the first book was more like I had to really power through. I just base it off of how I feel. Like that too. By the end of that, I was like, "Holy crap! What did I just read?" Mm -hmm. That's a five. Yeah. I don't care I like the wording, whatever. Like, if by the end of the book, I'm like, "What the heck was yeah. that?" Mm -hmm. Either because it was so beautiful or because it was so crazy or whatever. Like, if I have the what the heck feeling at the end, it's a five. Yeah, it got me there. It got me. And so, yeah. you got me. That was a five. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm going to cut it here because I think we're going we're gonna to jump to talking about some spoilers. So, I'm going to cut it here for those of you who don't want to hear any spoiler things. Just because I want to vent about some specific stuff. So Spoiler warning. Yeah, there's a spoiler warning coming up. But if you're going to stop watching here... Thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope you watch your next video. Go into the description box and follow all my stuff so you can keep hearing Getting about what updated. we're doing. Yeah. But if you choose to stay because you don't care about spoilers. Or you've read the book. Or you've read the book. So you know. What? what the heck just happened at the end? Okay, again. You left, right? Yeah. I'll give you a second. Leave if you don't want right. anything else. Leave. Out if you don't want to know stuff. Okay, now that you're here. Tamlin. What? <laughs> I hate him. I'm sorry, Tamlin, ugly. Hate him. Lucian, Lucian, however like you say his name, also Coward. ugly. 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 Ju what is it? Jurian? Jurian. Ugly. The oh, king, ugly. ugly. The queens, ugh. 
little conniving with little, little, little. Yeah. <laughs> but obviously they're the ones that ran out the other queen, I'm sure. Oh yeah. But then where's the sixth queen? Oh, only four. I'm sure I'll find out. Or she gone. <laughs> but makes me wonder. Or is it that priest is she the sixth queen? No. I don't know. Doesn't make sense. I don't know. Maybe. Uh, Reese and she's the Kara. High, they're sneaky girly pops. She's the high lady. Good for her. High lady. Uh, but you see, that's what they're talking about when they said that if you read her, if you read this lady's books, that everything just brings back because from the very beginning they were like high ladies do not exist. Uh uh. Yeah. And now she was and snatched the title. Okay, queen. Okay, mm -hmm. high lady. Mm -hmm. Also, L Lucian, like, becoming uh, Elaine's mate. Are you joking me? In the middle of a crisis. Are you joking me? They're having a little moment and everyone's like, could you, like, could you pay attention? Yeah, they're like, well, not right now. Excuse me. Not right now. There's enough mating going on. It's not ready for that. Though. Also, the concept that, that Reese was trying to stay still so that they couldn't smell the mating. <laughs> oh, sorry. <laughs> what? <laughs> Ew! <laughs> like, I'm all for, like, the romance and whatever, the smut and everything, but... Smelling. Smelling the hormones drifting off ya. Settle down. <laughs> That's gross. I'm sorry. Settle down. Ew. I just feel like I blew right through it. I kind of had a feeling the high burn, the high burn, whatever. How do you call it? What do you call that? Hibern? I don't know. High burn? High burn? I kind of had a feeling that was going to be a trap. To some degree. It seemed too easy. Because when they said, like, we're just going in and out, I'm like, there's no way. Yeah. I'm surprised he let them go. I hope that Cassian's wings get better. Yeah, that's... But sad. I feel like they might not, or they're going to be, like, super injured or something, and that's going to be sad for him. Yeah. He's a, He's a good boy. Also, him and Nesta, they better start something up. I think they will. They better. Because... I heard that there's another, that later on we hear about Nesta more. Yeah. So... She would be going for Cassian. Maybe they're going to be mates too. On another mate. Wait, wait, wait. I kind of remember it. Also, the fact that both of her sisters are now Faye too. The dad's going to come back and be like, like, what? What is going on? Not my daughters. What? And the fact that, uh, the fact that the the drawer that she drew the little knight on that, is from him. That was from a, a That was a great like backstory like <laughs> situation of like I was like, whoa. And the fact that like he had like visions of her like, uh, before they even met. But I just love that. Yeah. No, it's like. I also love that thing. they added his chapter. Yes, at the added. end. Yeah, that was good. Yeah, I appreciate that. Normally, I don't like the swapping back and forth, but that, but that was, was good. a needed one. Wow, that was great. Mm -hmm. That was great. I think we're gonna do this for every book going forward, where we're gonna have a little session of like, yeah, what? <laughs> Try not to leave too many spoilers in the comments, though. Yeah, obviously it goes without saying, don't spoil anything um, in comments. I'm gonna just have like the warning and it be this section, but like, obviously try to keep it to that. Eventually, if we got to the point where we had a lot of subscribers, we had like a big good community going and we wanted that more like book club feel, I would go to like another website to do that. like. A Discord, a Patreon, or something else to like separate the Get two. Get it all in there. So yeah. And really hash it out. Yeah, because it's really only fair to like everyone to not have a super spoiler town. You know, like I want my videos to be for everyone. And then mm -hmm. maybe this last segment going forward be spoilers if you want to hear it. But well, that was all we have to say because now I'm tired. <laughs> yeah. We've read this book all day and all day yesterday. We basically read it in two sittings. Yeah. So. Good for us. Crazy town. We're gonna go. We're going to slumber. And then I have to edit this video. And then you're gonna see it. And then we're gonna start this process all over again. And then we're just gonna keep doing it. So, keep reading. Thank you for watching. Bye! I'm um, too tall. <sighs> Always the tall kid. Every time. Not me, huh? It's happening. We're reading. Man, I got these stickers on here, man. Doesn't look professional. <laughs>